going back to when I was eight years old, I remember it was around Christmas time and my mom was still pregnant with my brother. And uh, this is when she was clean and sober. And I remember asking her because her mom was deceased. So I never knew her, my grandmother from my mom. And then my dad's mother was deceased. And I was little where it's like, I hardly mem remember her. So I remember asking her the question um, around the holidays, like why does God take away all the black grandmothers away from their grandkids because I just remember like ha my friends around me had grandparents or people always like when they had the grandparent bring your grandparent day at school and I'm like I didn't have any grandparents so she was like she basically said that God calls people home when he's ready and I just was eight years old so I was like well I hope that you're here when I do have kids because you know so um now we're gonna fast forward back to the body so after they like took the body out and stuff like that um that i remember them asking well who's who's in charge or who's the oldest and no one said anything for a while like my older sister was there and everything and no one said anything so after like i said i'm always having to be the adult in every situation so it like i didn't like I cried a little bit but then a switch clicked on and it was like I had to channel that energy and push it back and I was like well I'm the oldest because my older sister wasn't saying anything so that's when I was the one who was doing all the um, paperwork and preparing for the funeral and all that other stuff so and I remember emailing my teachers and my teacher saying oh um, if you need to you can file this letter and you can just pick up later and I was like no I need to finish this semester because it's only like a month left of school so I was trying to do a funeral finish school figure out the situation with my brother because he was only 12 so I was trying to do all of this stuff and so and then on top of that me at this time me and my husband we were engaged so when I told him it was like they wouldn't send him back home from the military because we weren't married and even if we were married or whatever it's not technically his parents so they weren't going to send him back so i had to deal with all of this <laughs> on my own oh lord the lord is my strength so um uh, i went through all of that and after finally after all of that was said and done funeral and stuff everything was done it was ex everything was done so we okay so i think i'm gonna end this part two right here i know i went through high school all the way up to when i was 20 but that's okay i might split it i don't know but anyways thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching this segment of who is jasmine barton moore um the next segment what i guess will be about like my adult life um, that might be broken up into two, but uh, just stay tuned. Don't forget to follow my blog, my website, and my social medias. I'll leave all those links below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.